This is, this is giving. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Tamara. If you're new here, my channel probably consists of beauty, a little bit of fashion, and a little bit of lifestyle. I've been doing a lot of lifestyle lately, but today we're getting into the fashion portion of things, starting with this super cute robe. It's giving homebody. The clothes that I actually picked up definitely are not giving homebody. Today I'm featuring JLux label once again. It is a brand that I have like a love-hate relationship with. Like sometimes I feel like I'll find really cute stuff and sometimes it'll be like there's nothing on the site. So I actually haven't shopped there in a while and I haven't done a try on all in a while because it's giving very much so you need to repeat the clothes that you have instead of buying new ones, but no, it is what it is. So I found some cute stuff so you can get some cute stuff so we can all have some cute stuff. You know, it's like a win-win situation, but I'm definitely talking too much now. So let's get into this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, all that. I'm almost at 200 followers, so let's keep subscribing. Let's keep building. Thank you so much for all the continued support. Now, let's get into this video. We are starting off so strong in this fuchsia midi, I think it's called mesmerized dress. I don't know, I'm supposed to be like, girl, what are you wearing? Um, but it's cute. Material is so thick. It's ribbed, but it's super thick. It has this really cute like lace detailing on the front and on the back. I feel like it fits like so well. I don't know if you can see the bottom. I'm gonna zoom out a little bit to see if you can. If I step all the way back, yep, you can see the bottom. I don't really go places these days as you can see by me starting off my robe because that's what I wear majority of the time when I am home. But if I'm ever going out of town, going out with friends, out for like a girls night, or if I'm going out on like any of the vacations that I have coming up, possibly in the future, I don't actually have anything booked yet. I could totally wear this. It's super comfortable. It's long enough where like, you're not gonna have to be pulling it down when you're walking. Um, don't really remember how much this is, but JLux Label also has been having a lot of sales. So if you are not for paying whatever this costs, I totally wait for a sale. Cause I think it's sale price, it's totally worth it. There obviously is a lot of chest going on here. I just wear covers, so you obviously cannot wear a real bra with it. I think I'd wear it with like strappy heels, even though this is strappy. I feel like I'd wear it with some tie up heels, cute little purse, some gold earrings and call it a day. I'm wondering if you tie it tighter if it like pulls this front area a little bit more because I feel like I would really appreciate that because when you have a chest, sometimes, oh, there goes label. Sometimes it helps when you can like tighten things and do things in certain directions. Let's see. Mm. Nope, it just tightens back. I thought it'd be like a whole like contraption thing where like pulling back here would pull up here, but um, unless I'm doing it wrong, it looks like it should be able to, like, cause this part connects to this. But either way, you may potentially be able to like tighten it a little bit in the back, but I can't figure that out right now. But so far, I think we're starting off strong. I really like this. I don't know where I'm gonna wear it to yet, like I say in every video, but I'm sure I'm gonna find a place with this color so bomb. It'd be perfect for summer. Perfect for like any like beach vacation. I really like how it looks on my skin. Plus pink is my favorite color, so you know, that's always a plus. But this is the first one. I don't know if I said what size I got it in, but this is a medium. Starting off strong. Let's try on the next one. Mistakes are already being made in this try on haul. I got makeup on this white dress. I am pissed. So hard to get your makeup out, but this dress is, where's the beach? Where is the beach? I just wanna go on the beach. Where's the beach? This dress, first and foremost, it's fitting me really interesting. I think I just need to like tighten up the straps a little bit. Like it's like super fitted through here and then it's loose here and then it's loose here. You actually can, there's like a little bit of an opening here on the side, you can tie it. I would suggest that so nothing comes popping out. But it gives you this nice little hole. This is what the back looks like. I am in love with this. This is so cute. Wait, Jay looks label. Jay looks label. Sometimes they have some things. These are one of the things. This is giving very much so beach vacation. I actually thought I was gonna wear this in Colombia, but uh, Colombia, I feel like the vibe in Colombia isn't like that dressy, at least the places that we went. So obviously this thing get busted out, 
but this is so cute. I love the little detail on the side. I like that it's not like super fitted through my bottom. Like it doesn't look like super tight. I am going to adjust the straps though because I feel like this is excessive and it just makes it look really weird that it's like so like fitted so well through the middle and then like so loose at the top. So I'm gonna do that real quick and I'll be right back. I don't know, I tightened it a little bit and I almost feel like I almost like it better with like the looser straps. But you comment down below and let me know. But either way, this is a, this is a hit. This is a banger. You can definitely wear this with like sandals, like if you are like going to dinner on the beach. How many of us actually go to dinner on the beach? It's winter in Minnesota right now, so like I'm really just daydreaming of like better weather because it's been like negatives. I almost slid into a median today because it's slick on the streets. So like I'm just like daydreaming of being on a beach. I'm wearing this with like a cute little beachy purse, maybe some like low heels or just sandals and like this would be a vibe. Same thing gold jewelry because I really don't even wear silver jewelry but I really like it. This is, this is giving. Right now I can't decide like which one is winning. Is it the other one that I tried on first or this one? They both just give like very different vibes but like I'm in love with this. I think this is a super popular dress too because there was many times when I went to go and buy this dress because when I saw it I was like, uh, I need that. It was sold out, so they have in a lot of different colors. There's a mocha color that I debated on getting, and then there's like a yellow, I think there's an orange, but I felt like the white just really gave me the vibe that I needed. I would maybe get in a different color if I could get in like a mocha. I'm really into the browns these days, but I definitely love this dress. I love that it's another one of those where you don't have to like pull it down while you're walking because it's like riding up your thighs, even though it is a shorter dress, so. I feel like this fits me perfectly. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed right now. How it fits in my midsection? Obsessed. All right, well, I'm gonna try and get the makeup out of like this piece here, and I'm gonna try on the next piece. We're not all about the going out dresses over here. So sometimes we need a nice little maxi dress, and that's what this is giving. This is a super, I can't remember what it's called. I know that this is not available on site because I had to get this in a large because a medium was in my basket, and when I went back to buy, it was gone. So, <laughs> we got this in a large. That's why I feel like it's like a little bit on the lumpy side. Like it's a little bit shapeless. I feel like if I could just like tighten it a little bit more, it'd look a lot better than what it is right now. I will show you the bottom as well, I'll lower my camera. Um, but this is what the back looks like. But this is super cute too. It's definitely giving like, we're going to a nice brunch. We're going to a little bridal shower. Maybe a baby shower if it's in the spring. I mean, the bridal shower would have to be in the spring too, but like, I think this is like so cute, pretty covered up. I mean, there is a little bit of opening in the back, but I feel like it doesn't give like Gucci. I don't know if that's the word I'm looking for, but I feel like it doesn't give like, she's showing too much skin. I feel like it's like showing just enough skin. But you comment down below and you let me know what you think. Like, where would you wear this to? What would you wear this with? I definitely envision some like pinky nude mules. Or actually brown shoes. I think brown shoes would actually be really cute with this. And I think I'm just gonna have to get this adjusted. When I like pull it in a little bit more, I feel like it just like looks a lot better as opposed to like when I just let it hang. I'm gonna adjust my camera a little bit so that you can see the bottom, but it is like a knitted sweater. It's definitely like multi-seasonal. You can like throw a little jacket on even if it is a little bit colder outside. It looks like I want to be moving back to the top of my list here because so far there's nothing that I do not like. I'm gonna try and show you the bottom of this dress though and show you how long it is on me. I am 5'4", so that will give you like a good indicator as to like where it might fall on you. So it actually, I hope you can actually see it. This goes like right above my ankles. I'm about to be toes right now. So if you can see where the bottom is. And then there's a nice little slit in the back too. So definitely giving a little bit of skin, a little bit of classy. I think it's like a nice little mix. I was thinking that my friends need to have more events so I can like wear things like this as well. I think I'm definitely gonna get this tapered in. Just kind of sucks because like if you've been to the tailor lately, you know that sometimes the tailor ends up being more expensive than what you actually paid. So it's like, why, why am I even doing this? Is anybody else experiencing this? Because like, I'm like, do I need to get a sewing machine and learn how to sew so I can tailor things? Cause right now paying money for the tailor in addition to what I paid for the dress, it's just, the math isn't really mathing right now, but I will say I forced this purchase because once the medium was gone, I should have let it go, but I thought it was so cute that I needed it, so I'm paying for it. I think it was well worth purchase. I would actually wear silver jewelry with this. I said I don't really wear silver jewelry, but 
I would totally wear silver jewelry with something like this. I think this actually might be the last dress I got from there. So I got three dresses so far. I'm gonna try and link them all down below, but if they're sold out, I'm not gonna be able to. But for the most part, I got these all in mediums, this one large because the medium sold out. All these white items are going straight into the washer. Like how, I covered my face and everything and I still got makeup all over the collar of my shirt. And I'm so angry. Cause sometimes I cannot get makeup off. I know if you like scrub it with like Dish soap that might help, but whatever. I'm not here to talk about how to get makeup off of white clothes, even though I keep staining them. Excuse my hair, I think it got a little bit messed up when I was trying to change. But this is my next item. It's crop top. It's a super plain crop top. It's a little bit see through as well. I don't know if you can tell, but I decided to get this because I feel like I have a really hard time finding, like, I just want to throw on like a regular top and just like go. And I don't have one of those, so I was like, okay, this is a good option. It's long sleeve for if it's like colder outside. I can just throw on some like high waisted jeans and go. These jeans are a little bit bigger, so excuse that as well. Super comfortable, it's super soft. I don't know what the material is. It's kind of like a sweater material, but it's just like a super chill top, even if you're just gonna go like grab drinks. I did have a little bit of an issue with the bra, like it kind of sticks out at the bottom. So I guess just wearing a more accommodating bra or if you want to wear like a bralette or something like that. I'm not blessed enough to be able to wear bralettes and have some good support, so I'm still wearing this bra. But this is what the back looks like, nothing too crazy. There is some like fraying at the bottom, which kind of adds as well, but super simple, super cute, got makeup all over it. I'm super pissed, even though I cover my face. I think there's a couple different colors, but I feel like sometimes white just like pulls everything together, so this is this top here. Jeans are not from JLux label. I think I actually got these from like H&M. I'm actually gonna throw on the jacket that I got from JLux label over this. It's gonna be a little bit matchy-matchy, but probably already seen it because I took forever to shoot this haul, but let's just pretend like you didn't see it before and this is the first time. I think this is giving like a very 90s, excessive like light blue with like a crop. Everything is like oversized. I think these jeans are actually like 90s style jeans as well. I'm never like really like a denim on denim person, but like, Looking in the mirror, I kind of like it. I feel like this could be a cute outfit. This jacket, I think it's more so like an oversized shirt. So what I envisioned when I bought this is I would just be able to like button it all the way down. As you can see, it goes to like right above my knee and just wearing like some like super cute thigh high boots. Like I'm not gonna try it on right now because I don't know where my thigh high boots actually are, but just like envision what that would be like. Like this thigh high boots. Hair like slick back, some big hoop earrings. I feel like it'd be such a look. But I can also just wear this as a jacket. I have worn this as a jacket before. It is actually a small. So like if you see this and you wanna get it, like this is what a small looks like. It's super oversized, so if you got a medium, that'd probably be really big. I would suggest maybe sizing down because it is so oversized, but I guess if you have the idea like I do where you wanna wear it as a shirt, which it technically is a shirt, I'd maybe size up because it probably gives you a little more length than the small does. I'm clearly here for like the ripped style of stuff because like everything that I'm wearing right now is ripped, but as an outfit, I feel like I kind of like dig this. So you might actually see me wearing this in the future. Stay tuned. All right, let's go try the next item. If there's one thing that I'm good for rocking, it's a bodysuit. You can dress them up, you can dress them down, and I feel like you can almost never go wrong with the JLux label bodysuit. The material is always so thick, so it almost helps like pull everything in. You can definitely adjust the straps in the back as well, and I'd actually wear this with darker jeans, but I couldn't find my darker jeans, so we're just gonna go with this. I might actually wear these with lighter jeans too. I feel like with bodysuits, I have basic colors like black, brown, gray, but like just getting like a nice little color to like zest up an outfit, especially if you're just like throwing on jeans and like same thing, just going for drinks. If you're going to a day party or if you're like on vacation, like me and my friends and all we rock our bodysuits, even though we bring these super cute clothes, these are the perfect thing to get. I feel like there hasn't been a bodysuit that I've gotten from JLux label that has been a miss. So if you're someone that's looking for nice, thick bodysuits, JLux label is definitely the place for you to go. I think this was actually on sale. So I think I got this for like a reasonable price. Like I said, they're always having sales. I got this in a medium as well. I don't think I have much to say about it because the bodysuit is a bodysuit is a bodysuit, but a JLux label bodysuit, top tier. I think we're down to the wire here. I think we're down to the last item. So I'm gonna go try that on and I will be right back. Remind me what I just said again, a bodysuit is a bodysuit is a bodysuit. 
Obviously, I had to get another one. This one's long sleeve though, but it has this really cute like scoop neck. I actually wore this out to drinks the other day, so another one of those things where you can dress up, dress down. I wore it with jeans. You could definitely wear it with like a skirt. The material is like super soft. It's like knit. It's not like super contouring or anything where it like sucks you in, but it definitely does like cling to your skin. I would definitely get another one of these. I would get several of these. This had a lot of colors in it. This is more like a light mocha type color. I'm getting more into like the browns, but I would get this and like every single color because I love the material. I love how it fits. I love how comfortable it is. I live in a colder state, so it's nice to have like bodysuits that do have sleeves. So if you're going out, you're not like freezing cold. I am well past the days. You guys saw that meme where like you're going out in your Charlotte Russe dress. Can't do it anymore. I'm all for comfort these days. Totally going for the long sleeves. Probably some booties because stilettos just don't do it for me anymore. But you may see me in a pair of stilettos here or there. But that's like totally besides the point. But this bodysuit I love. I definitely will be getting more colors in this just because it is like so functional. I can wear it to so many different things. And the material's great. All right, y'all, well that is all that I got for this haul. I got a few dresses, got a few bodysuits, of course, and a jacket. Comment down below and let me know which one was your favorite. And also comment down below and let me know if you will be picking up any of these items, if you already have any of these items, and how you would style them. Thank you so much for watching once again, and I will definitely see you in my next one. I'm gonna try and be more consistent in 2023. Working full time, it's so hard to stay consistent, especially when you get exhausted, but my goal for 2023 is to be more consistent, so I will see you in 2023. Thanks so much for watching, bye.